Well, welcome to another uh, Memphis drawing. This is a drawing. We're going through the 200 drawing prompt book and today we're up to drawing prompt 179. Our drawing prompt tip for today is biplane and we were true to the uh, prompt and drew the Sopwith Camel, the British uh, biplane from World War One. If you want to see how we did it, stay tuned because that's what we're going to do today. This is the uh, Fokker Wolf World War uh, One biplane. They made these in two things. They they had triplanes and biplane planes. Uh, this is the uh, famous Sopwith. Camel, uh, British. I think we're gonna draw our version of this. Let's get started. I think this is kind of cool. I get to use my uh, my ellipse drawer here to draw the uh, the engine cowling in this bin right. Right here, the propeller will come out and all that stuff. And here's the the left wheel. It's always uh, fascinated me how fast aviation uh, advanced from the Wright brothers to the First World War. What I'm trying to do now is uh, draw a propeller. At uh, 50 degree angle. Trying to get this propeller about halfway right, and having some difficulty. They started out with uh, radial engines that didn't have these cowlings over them. They actually had the whole the whole engine uh, turned and carried the propeller with it. Okay, I just. Uh, 
drew in the and they usually had a a letter these had a letter looks like they had a in our example here they got a big N right there Let's put that in Once you start using a ruler in a drawing, I've discovered, you about got to continue where it looks uh, where your free hand looks kind of weird. Since our plane's uh, flying, I'm going to put in a blue background. To finish that background, I need to fix this, fix our pilot here. These are World War II, World War I plane. You know, they, uh, they knew airplanes were going to be valuable, and they were going to be more valuable as time went on. But they hadn't figured out exactly how to use them yet. And so they kind of started out as observation platforms. You know, you could fly above the enemy. It was actually pretty safe duty because, you know, you could fly up, you know, three, four thousand feet, you tell what the enemy was doing, and they couldn't do anything about it. But that changed pretty quickly. They, uh, Pilots started bringing guns with them and shooting at one another. Well, today I'm going to be smart. I'm going to start drawing over on the left. Yesterday, remember, we were... We started... Yesterday, we started drawing these flowers over here. And we had all this done. And then we had to do all this. So I had to put my hand right on top of that. Uh, we're... We're living and learning, huh? I talked to my brother a little bit yesterday on the phone and I, funnier than heck, I, because I knew the answer, you know, I said, hey, you've been watching my, uh, been watching my new art videos, my new drawing videos, you know, then you get that little stagger in the voice. Uh, 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 um, I, I, I watched part of one. Yeah, I'm working my way. Talking to myself. In the uh, editing, 
you'll see that sometimes I'll be finishing I'll be finishing a story that you don't know the beginning to that's because I edited it out because I'm too uh, too windy Now this <coughs> plane's kind of running, all the colors are kind of running together. These planes were, uh, well, all planes until the 1920s were made out of canvas and wood they weren't uh, they weren't very good about they weren't good about flying in bad weather now the undercarriage here Start over on the left, it's basically black. I'll leave some streaks of light in it. I'm going to bring out some detail in our airplane here. Um, and then with some black ink. And then the last thing I'll do is draw in the uh, these guy wires. I, I did my uh, a lot of my lines with rulers and also used my uh, my lips jig but I'm going over the I'm going over the the, uh, the lines freehand I'll give it a more natural look. I'm such a hypocrite. I just said if you use ruler on one thing you need to use it on everything but I think the guy wires need to be perfectly straight
Well, I guess that'll do it for another Memphis drawing. Uh, today's prompt was biplane, and we drew the famous British biplane from World War I, the Sopwith. I think this is a camel, but I'm not sure. All right, let's see what our prompt is for tomorrow. It is banana split. All right, hope to see you then.